So what I did yesterday, um, early afternoon, I ended up going down the rabbit hole of Derek Savage. If you don't know who Derek Savage is, Derek Savage is a creator of the, this character called Cool Cat. And basically it first started off as kids books and then it um, transpired to him making movies um, and failed promises of it's a whole rabbit hole just <laughs> just get into it just go into it I will say people's overreaction towards the guy um is a little bit overly kind of like the overly hate over him I mean there's some things that happened which made him a little bit of a creep with one incident um but I think he's just someone who kind of he had an idea but realised he didn't have the budget for it. That's why he couldn't that's why he changed the movies. I know it's just it's not a greatest uh, greatest thing to actually do, especially when people pledge money um for that particular film. But I think people's hate towards him is kind of a little bit over dramatized. So this film. Now this one cool cat cat saves the kids. So this is the first film. Um now this is on Prime Video. Now this is the director's cut. So I believe there's been like two director's cuts of this movie. So I'm not I'm gonna assume this one is the latest director's cut. It's not the original. So this has got added clips, which we'll get into in a minute. So the movie itself. How is it? Is it is people is the hate towards it overly hatred? Um so when it comes to the script, it's very very cringy at times like very cringy so the character of the bully is just cringe and actually <laughs> so is um Derek Savage in the movie he's a little bit of a cringe it's just the script is a cringe fest overall to be fair um another thing with it is as I said this is director's cut so it's added clips now the problem with the added clips it takes away the actual main plot of the movie see the plot of the movie um, which I forgot to mention but the plot of the movie is basically about you know bullies basically and about standing up for yourself against bullies great moral thing the problem is with the added clips it takes away from the plot and extends it extends the film more than it needs to be because it it gets to the point where it's actually painful to carry on watching it because it's way too long if this was just an hour long I would sort of I mean it's still a cringe fest but I I it sort I it'd be decent enough um but the fact that this movie is an hour and 45 minutes oh it's just, I, I couldn't help myself checking how many minutes have I got left of this film because it's hurting my brain. <laughs> I'm sorry, it was hurting my brain um, because it was, just, it was just too long for what it is, too long for what it is. I will say, to give advice to this guy, he should just be doing, YouTube is now big and everything, he should just doing, should be do a mini-series of Cool Cat on YouTube. It shouldn't be like, trying to reach the goals of doing these movies and then not being able to kind of produce them um I think there's another film that's come out it's got someone like dvds and stuff I think there's a recent one with okay I saw a clip of it and it's this dog right so cool cat has an enemy now and this dog's rapping it was the cringiest thing I've ever seen him haunt to life, but I couldn't stop watching it. Anyway, I think basically moving forward, he should just do videos on YouTube, 15 minute videos of like, you know, morals like bullying and, you know, you know, help maybe um safety videos, stuff like that to help children learn. But I think when you try and expand to movies, that's where it's kind of a bit what's it just stick to like fifteen minute YouTube videos and you'll be fine. If I was to rate this <laughs> this film, which I don't even know how to rate this. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna go with okay, I'm gonna go with I'm gonna give it to, I'm gonna Okay, I'm going to give it 2 out of 10, okay. It's cringy. The storyline, the, 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 um, storyline, the, um, the, uh, what do you call it again? The script is cringe, okay, the lines are cringe, but it has potential, but it was way too long for what it was, and 
yeah, it was, yeah, just, I'm going to give it a two out of five. But yeah, that's it for this review. Safe bye, guys.